is full use of the little toe. <laughs> That's all mine does. Does that little toe spread so you can remove sock lint? That's what it's for. I was here at the West Virginia Organization of Nurse Executives meeting, and Dave is the funniest person I have ever heard. Of. This is the, I laughed so hard. In fact, you did get the uh, incontinence that you had before. <laughs> I've seen enough old movies, you drink seawater, you go crazy and drown. <laughs> it's like I said, Dave is really interesting. Uh, you're, getting, you're getting entertained, but you're learning a whole lot about joy. Charlie Chaplin said, if you want to truly laugh, you gotta, you gotta take your pain and learn how to play with it. I remember when she got close enough, I read the t-shirt. It said, hair by chemo. <laughs> what she understood was, that even in that life and death experience, there were choices. And then we realized that if staff weren't happy, they're not going to give good customer service. The staff could not have been happier. I had several of them come up to me afterwards and say, this is the best we have ever had. What focus do you choose? Is what you're doing a blessing or is it pain? You get to decide. I thought it was fabulous. It gave me lots of new ideas for things to use with my clients and myself. You ever have a dog like that? Kind of casual about that whole housebreaking thing, like, is that important to you? I'll try. You know, that kind of thing. <laughs> Heave a big sigh, he goes, ah, I wish I had a stay free. He said, well, they protect side to side, front to back. And they have wings. They actually had an x-ray of his skull in profile, knife in the head. And I looked at that, I was horrified, and I thought, I, and I don't know much about medicine. Do you really need an x-ray to diagnose that particular problem? Thank you, Dave, for making my day. Humor is a lifesaver. It's not a respiration pattern, it is a force of nature. You ever in a situation to, where you, 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 it's really inappropriate to laugh and yet you're about to laugh? <laughs> you ever have that situation? And you're trying to hold it in and you gotta be careful because it'll find another exit. <laughs> <laughs> it'll take stuff with it too. Everybody's laughing, we're all having fun and that was great. I needed that too today when I was coming here. You've gotta try it, so here's what we'll do. I'll count to three. And then you give me your best Duchesne smile. Now, I will tell you. Oh, listen to the people groaning. Oh, I don't want to smile. I didn't know we'd have to work. When we do these things, when I choose joy, when I make it a commitment to it that's mission level, right? When I begin to share it with other people with something as simple as the smile on my face, that Duchesne smile, and I spread this joy and I make it a commitment to finding that on a daily basis and sharing that with others, wow, it's a life changer. Your influence changes. Your success level changes. Your level of happiness changes. You go back to that mission, it will help you succeed in ways that really are real measurements of success. It'll help you serve in ways that serve people's emotional needs as well as the wonderful skills that you provide in whatever job it is you do. And finally, you've taken a giant step toward bringing joy to the moment, to the process, to your life and to others. It's like a cross between Moses and Jim Carrey. <laughs>